Our area, most school aged children practice active shooter drills at school, leaving some anxious. WDRB's Monica Harkin shows us how one Louisville counseling office is using art to help kids cope with their emotions. I'd say this is like a mountain right here. With each breath, then. eight year old Brooks is scaling his own mountain. Mountain breathing. It's part of the creative coping skills he learned at Bloom Counseling. He gets frustrated pretty easily, so which is why I decided to sign him up for the class. His mom, Christy Weber, is a licensed counselor and owns the practice. The new art sessions are offered by one of her therapists, Erica Quarles. Erica works with the kids to be able to identify what they're feeling and then to be able to learn coping skills. Skills Weber says can be difficult for some parents who didn't experience those lessons themselves as a child. A lot of, um, you know, adults our age, they were told, you know, to stop crying and basically just suck it up, you know, and so now I think this generation is doing a better job of saying, you know, it's OK that you're really upset. In a time when children's worries have escalated to the level of active shooters, Weber's first piece of advice for parents is start conversations with your kids on the normal days. Trying to have those open conversations um, with your children so that if they do experience like some worry or depression, that this is not the first time you've ever had a conversation. Then when your child comes to you about hard topics. If your child is asking you a question, it means developmentally they are ready to hear the answer. That doesn't mean you tell them everything, but in an age appropriate way, you need to be able to answer, you know, what they're asking. And when things escalate. Shake it and it like gets your angle out. They can turn to some positive outlets, like this DIY calming jar, to help let things settle. In Louisville, with photojournalist Brian Manuel, Monica Harkins, WDRB News.